Felicien Kabuga, the presumed financier of the genocide against the Tutsis, had previously been deemed unfit for trial by the UN court handling his case. The prosecutor had lodged an appeal seeking a revival of the trial. However, on Monday, the appeals chamber decreed an indefinite hold to the proceedings because he had been diagnosed with dementia. The uh, judges are now considering releasing Kabuga, who had eluded justice for 26 years before being apprehended in France in 2020. The disappointment among survivors' associations and random authorities is profound. For us, it's really a complete injustice, which didn't take into account the victims. They completely ignored the victims who lost their relatives during the genocide perpetrated against the Tutsis. It's regrettable to see the court release a dangerous man like Felicien Kabuga. Kabuga is currently held in a UN detention facility in the Netherlands awaiting a new assessment that will determine his potential release. In Rwanda, the Ibuka Association filed a complaint to seek financial compensation from Kabuga, known for his substantial wealth and rumored property holdings in the country.